All right, Mehul Gupta is our next question. Uh, it's 25 asks, is the, is the new travel and tourism index a good space to invest in? Says, I am looking to invest in the Tata Nifty India Tourism Index NFO. Now, this is also a great question, Shitish, because it gets, uh, you know, gives us an opportunity to explore so many themes, including thematic funds, NFOs. But let's start with a specific question from Mehul. What do you make of the new travel and tourism index? Oh, I, uh, I travel because of my work and I see uh, everywhere there are, irrespective of vacation, they are not there, they are travelers around. I think one mindset change, what has happened, and uh, as we speak, we are around $2,731 $2, per capita GDP. I think we have a lot to catch up. And once your GDP per capita GDP will cross 5,000, uh, 5,500 in the next four, five years time, your discretionary spend will go up, in which the travel, tourism, uh, buying a better car, anything which has to do with lifestyle, upgrading your own lifestyle, will, uh, you will see a remarkable jump. Second, in India especially, uh, we have seen that richest tourism is catching up really fast and uh, there are more travelers in Ujjain uh, than Goa. Now you will see the same thing happening in Ujjain and a few other places also. So that is also catching up really fast. So I think uh, tourism as a sector, as an industry, well and should do very well and not only in India but abroad also as far as the Indians are concerned. So you go out, you see a lot of Indians now, you have Indian food available everywhere. So I think the industry will do well. Now looking, when you look at an NFO uh, part, uh, one has to actually look at that uh, you should get into a sectoral fund or uh, uh, or any type of small cap fund uh, with a view that when, when you have the risk appetite which is on your side that yes, if the sector will not play well then you might end up uh, not making uh, the type of money which you're expecting. So that's my personal view, but it can be someone's view that sector will do very well. But then that risk capital, if you have with you, then you can look at participating in this type of fund from 5 to 8 percent is one uh, one can So uh, one minute, just one quick follow up there. Uh, and you're absolutely right. The industry is booming. You're seeing that in some of the listed players as well. Does the index or this particular NFO, that he's talking about the Tata Nifty India Tourism Index NFO, give you that kind of coverage and exposure to the travel boom? Because remember, the idea is to uh, capture that as an investment avenue. Yeah, it does, uh, Tamana. In fact, uh, uh, I talked to Tata, uh, you know, team here in uh, Bombay and Delhi, and they were talking to me about everything to do with travel. That includes your bags, that includes your uh, various other stuffs. Uh, food side, uh, your uh, airline, your, uh, 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 let's say, hotel industry, they're covering everything. So as you said in the beginning, it's a broader sector. So, uh, uh, you know, and it, it helps a lot of people when travel starts. It helps a chaiwala also who starts a teak stall near to some uh, tourist place. So it's a very broad sector and it will, it will actually uh, help a lot of people when the industry moves. So it will cover... Uh, on a holistic way, a lot of these uh, companies underline the fund.